I am here to answer the question, do I buy now or wait? I'm Jillian Petrash with the Jump Living Group and Jump Real Estate. With interest rates already rising and the word on the street being that they will rise a bit more this year, the question is coming up, is it better to buy now and save a little, or save a little more money and hope the market cools down? Interest rates in 2021 were in the twos, and this year they're already inching up into the fours. I had a client last week be quoted 4.5% on a 30-year fixed loan. On a $700,000 house, that means your payment's going to be about $600 higher. And when you're considering that the price of the home is probably 15% higher than it was last year, that can be intimidating. People are wondering, is the bubble going to pop? Is the market going to cool off? Can I get a better deal in a few months? If I buy now, am I going to be upside down on my home? I would argue that even with interest rates rising, you should hurry up and jump in sooner than later. I love a bargain and I hate overpaying for things. Even if you end up paying a bit more monthly, hopefully the appreciation you will see will counteract this. Then if rates drop again in the future, you can always refinance. With the lack of inventory that we currently have, I don't see prices dropping, even if demand slows down a little bit from people being priced out of the market. I did read an article this morning saying that 10% of buyers have already been priced out of the market in the last two weeks due to an increase in interest rates. Another thing I'm seeing is that people that are wanting to move and buy a new house are choosing to keep the current home that they have. The rental market is so strong and most homeowners are locked in with such low interest rates that there's no motivation to sell. I think on a micro level, this is contributing to the lack of inventory, and I don't see this changing anytime soon either. If you're on the fence about buying right now or waiting until later when maybe you'll have a 20% down payment, I would argue it's better to buy now. With the rate of appreciation, I don't think you can save enough money to make up for the time you'll spend out of the market. Also, if home values continue to rise, can get rid of your mortgage insurance in just a year based on appreciation. Now, obviously, I don't have a crystal ball, but I don't hear anyone predicting that rates are going to go down anytime in the near future. And ultimately, everyone has different circumstances and situations. But if you can afford to buy now, I would hurry up and get started looking. The market is still quite competitive, so you might end up putting offers on multiple homes before you end up where you're supposed to be. Also, if you are one of the few thinking to sell, I would say it's worth hurrying up and doing that in hopes that you can take advantage of only 10% of the people being priced out of the market. The longer you wait, the more people are going to be priced out of the market due to the rising interest rates. So if you're thinking about buying or selling, and I would love to chat with you and discuss your situation, give me a call.